32 medal place was born in 1913. He graduated from Rye High in 1932. Before World War II, he enlisted in the Marine Corps and received the battlefield promotion to second lieutenant at Wild Canal. He was killed at the age of 29 on July 9, 1943, during the Solomon Island campaign on the island of New Georgia in a place called Enagon. He was awarded a silver star for the courage and self-sacrifice under fire. He was buried temporarily in a U.S. military cemetery on the island of Munda. His remains were later buried at the National Cemetery in Farmingdale, New York. The following letter to Lieutenant Oldham's parents was published in the Wright Chronicle in 1943, 81 years ago. The letter was written by a fellow Marine, Charles Eddy, who visited Oldham's temporary grave. We think this letter beautifully captures the essence of Memorial Day. Quote, I am glad that I was able to see your son's grave. You and other parents, wives, families, and sweethearts have abundant cause to be proud of the ultimate sacrifice which American boys have laid on the altar of liberty on these desolate jungle islands. I wish that the true magnitude of the sacrifice could be brought home to everyone in the U.S. I am close enough to this job that is being done to appreciate the difficulties and hardships under which your son and his men fought. I feel humbled to be in the presence of such men. I revere the memory of those who are no longer living. They will give men an inner power in years to come to fight for what I know is right in the world. It is the privilege and responsibility of the living to carry on the fight for right in the world, right for which your son and many others have so nobly given their lives.